What is up, you guys? It's Closet Gamer back here again for more Age of Engineering. That's right. We're in our little hovel, but we've got no bed. Where is the bed gone? I hear you ask. Well, uh, it's quite prominent news at the moment. We are moving house again. That's right. Every episode we seem to move house, uh, but hopefully this will be a bit more permanent. So if I sounds a bit dangerous out there, um, but I'm going to make a run for it. Let's go. No. That was a bad start. Out of the way, skinny guy. Oh, loads of creepers over there. So, I've gone for... No! Fuck off! Oh, that was close. Unlucky, son. Right, anyway. Uh, as I was saying, I've gone for a kind of log cabin effect. That's very nice, isn't it? I've left the ceiling open so we can gaze up at the stars. And we can wonder about all the planets that are going on up there. All of the resources that are yet to be plundered. Quite interesting and exciting stuff. Uh, we can sort of stare wistfully into space like Brian Cox off of the telly. You know. Uh, Isn't the universe wonderful? Look at all the stars and the galaxies. Plus, it keeps your reflexes sharp as well when you're sort of anticipating a spider attack. There's one out there now. I can see him. Is uh, What are you looking at? He's going to turn now. Watch him. Watch him. Turn. No? Okay. Never mind. Uh, so, I've gone for a stone floor. Nice. Nice. And I can hear what you're saying. Waste of coal cooking up all that stone. But, um, I hear what you're saying, but I don't think you're right. Because I was watching Bear Grylls the other day. And, um, Bear Grylls was saying that shelter is more important than food and water. Uh, and, and who knows best? You know, you or Bear Grylls. I, I think Bear Grylls knows best, if I'm honest. So I decided to go with Bear Grylls and get my shelter sorted. So there. So that's cool. Um, so I've got the three main things. You know, I've got food. I've got my farm sorted up out there as well. But you didn't see that, did you? You know, I, I, I see people. I see people on, on Twitter and things saying, oh, oh. What freaking noob's got no farm? Do you even mind, bro? Etc. Etc. Well, look at that farm. But you've never seen one like that in your life, have you? Not in your life. We've got wheat. We've got granola. I think that's granola. Canola. Uh, we've got some industrial hemp. Just in case we fancy rolling one up later on. So that'd be great. Anyway, all of this stuff's on pause right now. Because we've got some engineering to do. That's right. So we spent last time mining and ploughing away for countless hours underground. Uh, now this episode, what we need to do is we need to get some of our Tinker's stuff set up. We need to make our Tinker's uh, workbench and things. We need to craft a pickaxe. Because remember when we was underground last time, there was loads of stuff down there that we couldn't actually get to. Uh, and I said that we need a diamond pickaxe. We don't need a diamond pickaxe. What we need is a diamond level pickaxe. So let me just show you something. So this is the uh, materials and me book, uh, or materials and you, or, or whatever it's called. Um, but what it basically tells you is all of the materials, and what their mining level is. So a stone pickaxe, mining level, iron. So it can m mine up to iron. Okay. So what we need, one that is capable of mining diamonds. So we can go with an iron pickaxe. Perfect. Uh, night slime pickaxe, but I don't even know where to get night slime actually. Blue slime, no, that's crap. Never rack, no. Magna slime, ardite, copper, bronze. Bronze could be quite good. The stats are a bit bigger, but it's more complex to craft, so I'll probably leave that at the moment. We'll just stick with diamond. Uh, iron, sorry. Diamond would be nice, but we're not going to have diamond. Um, so I'm going to try and. Can I sleep? Yes, I can sleep. Nice. So. Let's get crafting our Tinker's stuff. Right. There we go. Crikey, that's a lot of... It's a lot of... Um, oh, there's a skinny guy knocking about. All right, skinny guy. Uh, so it's just a normal crafting table we need, first of all. So we'll make one of those. One crafting table. And I think... That's it. Crafting station. Perfect. Right, so we need a chair. So we need some patterns, actually. So I think if we go like this... Uh, and like this... And then like this, that will give us some patterns. Now uh, we don't want too many, we don't want to use up all of our stuff. Uh, but we'll get a few, you know, we'll get how many? 
Yeah, we'll get 24. Nice. Uh, right, one of the other... I know one of the recipes off by heart. So the other recipe is made from that, like that. Part builder, perfect. We need a chest. No, a chest. That's wrong. That's not a chest. We need a chest. Uh, and we need one of these on top. That noise is doing my head in. Uh, pattern chest, perfect. Pattern chest. Right, now what is the other one? Is it one of these with this on top? We've got that, have we? No, we've not got that one. That's good. Need that one. And then there's one more that we need. Now what the friggin' hell is it? Tool forge. That's what we need. So we need uh, a crafting table and a blank pattern. Right, okay, no problem. We can do that. So, crafting table, another one of those, and then a blank pan. Wonderful. So, that's our full set, if I'm not mistaken, of Tinker's things. This guy, why are the monsters not despawning? Why are you still knocking about, creeper? It's daytime. Not time for you to be out and about. Right, so let's get our Tinker's workstation set up. Right, so our pattern chest is going to go there. Uh, part builder can go there. Uh, tool station can go there. Stencil table there. I think that works. Does that work? Yeah, I think that works. Uh, right, before we do that, before we go any further, have I got any clay? No, I've not got any clay. I think I've left my clay over there. Uh, let me just quickly eat this chicken. Nice. I can run now, that's good. Right, clay, where are you? Clay, oh, perfect. Because we need liquid clay, you see. Because what we're, what we're going to have to do is... Because what we're going to do, we can't make uh, metal casts for any of our tools yet. We have to make them out of clay. Unfortunate thing is that once you, when you do that, every time you do that, you lose the, you lose the clay. So what we need is... Uh, we need to get hold hold of our pattern crafter. Uh, we need some patterns. All right, what patterns do we need? So patterns. There we are. Uh, right, we need one of these. Just pop some patterns in there. Right, we need a tool rod. Wonderful. Yes. Uh, we need shovel. We need pickaxe, sword, and we also need an axe. So that's our patterns. Oh, and we also need a binding as well. So we'll make up. Make that out of iron as well. So what we need to do uh, is we need to put our pattern in there and then we need to make cobblestone versions of each one of these. Okay, so I'm just going to dump all that stone in. So one pickaxe head, one stone head. I need four bindings. One, two, three, four. Uh, we need the axe heads, one of those. Uh, and what was the other one? The sword. Was it the sword? Yeah, it was the sword, wasn't it? Perfect. Right, so we've got sword axe pickaxe and shovel four bindings and then we also need our tool rods we need four of those and they'll just be made out of sticks now our clay should be cooking up quite nicely in there so we'll sleep through the night oh there's monsters nearby where is he where are you son of a bitch where are you and why are you not letting me sleep is he on my roof you're on my roof, you jerk. Oh, I, I can't go out there because he's. Oh. Oh. Right, I'll wait. I'll be back. Okay, welcome back. It's a brand new morning. We had a brief encounter with a skeleton, and um, he kicked my ass. Uh, I did die. Never mind. Uh, it happened. Well, I've respawned right here anyway, so it's not a problem. And I deleted a death point as well. Otherwise, it will be sort of sticking up in the sky. If you want to be able to delete your waypoints, you press uh, the J key. And it's in waypoints there. So you can just remove it there. So that's pro tip for you there. Um, right, so what we need to do is hopefully all of the monsters are gone. Our clay should be nicely cooked by now. Uh, so what we're going to do, I'm not sure if I explained it properly last time, but there's still a creeper about. I'm just going to check around here. This little skinny guy. Uh, are you going to you going to cause us problems, mate? I really don't want to tangle with you today. Really not in the mood for it. 
let's check our clay how's our clay doing so we've got molten clay two blocks nice so what we need to do is we need to put our oh mate come on it's fast as well look at him oh look at him go oh he's on fire jumped in the water Big dodge, big dodge. He's on fire, he's on fire, is he gonna get it? Oh, he's gone, he's gone, thank God for that. He almost stabbed me there. Right, so first thing I wanna put down is my stone pickaxe head. I'll pop that in there, so what's gonna happen? I'm gonna hit that, the clay's gonna pour out and it's gonna go all around it and it's gonna make the opposite shape, okay? And that's gonna give us our mold for our iron. Because the thing is, what you'd normally do uh, in tinkers is you'd make your molds out of aluminium brass now the problem is is that we can't actually dig up aluminium brass until we've got an iron pickaxe and we can't make an iron pickaxe with an aluminium brass mold because we can't dig up the aluminium so we need to use clay uh, and the problem is is that clay obviously is single time use so we'll grab that mold let's put our Let's get our iron in there first. Right, so iron in. Is it gonna melt? Is it gonna melt? Yeah, it's gonna melt. Good. I thought we'd wasted it then. We're not really wasted it because um because the thing is, we can use that for iron buckets and stuff. We need an iron bucket because we need to get lots of lava at some point. So let's make another clay cast, shall we? Uh, and we'll do our bindings this time. So let's get one of our bindings and pop that in there. Go like this. Okay, cool. Wait for that to cool down. Cooling. Nice. Right, so now we've got any iron ready? Iron ready? Yes, we've got iron. Right, so if I click that, just left click it, that'll put the molten iron at the bottom and the clay at the top. So that'll be the first thing that comes out. And you can just you can click that as many times as you want. It's a bit a bit cheaty P. I don't think you could do that with a real with a real um with a real smeltery. There you go. Right, so iron pickaxe. In nope. Not that one. Nope. This one. That in. Okay. Iron, go. Here comes our iron pickaxe head. Nice. Yes, look, and see the clay's destroyed. Never mind. Right, so we need our iron binding. Go. Nice. Now, if we then go back to our Tinker's place. Right, we need to make a pickaxe. Perfect. Okay, so you can tell that I don't really know what I'm doing, can't you? Um, but I have read a little bit, so I do know a little bit. So you might... Iron pickaxe. And we will call it the pick of destiny. Perfect. The pick of destiny. Cool. Right, let's make the rest of our tools real quick. Right, so okay, let's cast our sh let's cast our axe first in case we run out of anything. To switch over to, to clay, cast that. Nice, perfect. Right, switch back to iron. Get the iron in there. Nice, filling up. That gives us our iron axe head. Nice. Right. Uh, another binding. We're running out of clay. But even if I just get a pickaxe and an axe, that'll be fine for me. Cool, cool. Uh, and then switch back to iron again. Nice. Actually, let's just put some more clay in there. Well, it's not like we're short of it, is it? There we go. Right. Uh, so switch back to iron again. Oh, I've already got iron in there. What's this? Is that our binding? That is this our binding, isn't it? What a moron. Right. Um Stone shovel head. Clay. Clay, good. Nice. We've not got enough clay. Oh, we've run out of clay. Just so it happens that we've just got enough. Cool. Switch back to iron. There's a lot of back and forth. Is that gonna be enough? Yeah, it's just enough. 
We need to put some more iron in here. Okay, let's melt this. All. Not going to not going to waste too much iron because the next stage is the industrial age, and we'll be able to double our ores in that age. So we've got our axe, we've got our shovel. We need our sword now as well. So let's pop our sword. Get our clay at the bottom in there. Back, switch back to iron again. Get the iron in there, and we need three more bindings. How's the iron doing? The iron almost melted? Yeah, the iron's melted. Let's pop a bit more iron in there. I think we're going to need a little bit more. Iron at the bottom to finish that off. Nice. We are cooking with gas. Right, uh, so another stone binding. Those. More clay. Back to iron again. And one last one. What's that? What did I just put in there? Stone binding. Stone binding and the clay's at the bottom. Is it going to be enough? Going to be enough? Oh yeah, just enough. Just enough. Last binding. Perfect. All right, let's get back in our house. Okay, wonderful. So we've got all of our bits that we need for our tools. So let's quickly make up our axe. Perfect. So let's pop that in there. Where is our? So we've got our, we've got our uh, tool rods in there as well. Let's get our bindings in there. Hatch it. Nice. Let's knock up our sword. Nice. And stored in there. Why is this? Why is this not working? Oh, I need a pommel. I haven't got a pommel. Shit. Never mind. Um, I can't make that then. Right, I might just quickly make a pommel in a minute. Actually, I've never made a pommel before. That goes on there like that. Perfect. Iron shovel. Let's quickly go and knock up a pommel. Because I think we're gonna we're gonna encounter some more monsters at some point. We need the clay. Uh, need to come back to the pattern chest actually to make this pommel. Right, pattern chest, where are you? There you are, stencil. So, pommel, 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 where are you? There you are. Fine. Let's make it out of cobblestone. Cobblestone pommel, nice. Okay, let's come back out here to our table. Nope, not that. I don't want to make that. Uh, I want to make this thing. Clay in. Nice. Switch back to the. Oh, oh we've got, that's all we've got left anyway. And the metal in there. Nice. So we can now go back and we can finish making our sword. Cool beans. Back to the house. Here we go. Right. So, sword. Don't want that in there. Want that in there. And we want that in there. Nice. Iron broadsword. Wow, we so look, we've got a full complement of tools now. How nice! So, what we can go and do is we can go and dig up some aluminium from the mines. So cool! So, we'll offload some of our stuff in there and then I'm off for a trip to the mines. Uh, I won't take you with me because it'll be boring, but I hope you enjoyed this episode. It's been good, we've got some good progress going on. Got our full set of tools now. Uh, next episode, we'll probably focus on our coke oven. So, I hope you join me for that, and I'll see you next time. Yeah!